Hey you guys, it's AK Skriller from AKSkriller.com showing you how to set up the phone after update 4. Um, here's the update 4. You can see at the top Google Talk glows colors and stuff when you got a, a, a talk message and all these cool icons um, even down here or in settings. Now we have all these back. Um, what I'm going to do is show you guys how to do this real quick, okay? So this is the update 4 um, that you can put on any CM7 ROM or on the Skriller 7 V3 ROM, okay? And here's how we set this up. First what we do is after you flash it, you guys are going to realize in your app drawer there's not a lot of apps. Um, you're going to go to the market and get your Gmail and your YouTube. Um, you shouldn't have those in your system folders. You should just get them from the market. That way they auto-update all the time, okay? Um, First, what we're going to do is after flashing, you're going to go into the app drawer and you're going to get the theme chooser. Okay? When you're in the theme chooser, this is where you can grab one of these themes. Okay? So all you do is pick a theme and hit apply. And whatever theme you pick is going to give you these cool icons all over the place and this up here. So when it's moving in colors, or as you can see when I'm charging, this little dot goes across the top. All right. After So now we just went into the theme chooser and made all the icons on the phone. Now what we're going to do is go to menu and then there's a theme right here. Touch that and inside here you can download right here or set up themes for your launcher. Okay? Or you can click down here download more themes and it's all free. Okay? And all you do is simply touch one of them and it will download like in the market or if you already have the theme just touch it and then simply hit apply and it applies the theme what that theme just did is it changed all this to the the honeycomb the background the picture all that stuff okay now that we've changed the icon themes and the launcher themes for everything what we're going to do now is we are going to set up the phone so you go to menu you go to settings first thing we're going to do is go to extra tweaks we have lock screen settings choose lock screen style pick any of these styles mine's on honeycomb the honeycomb lock screen looks like this it's the lock ring let's go ahead and move it over alright so now that that's there we'll go back to menu settings extra tweaks that was the lock screen settings a lot of options clock options same thing you can change the color like mine's purple and then um, battery options I'm using the MIUI battery bar that's the one that's up top you can barely see the little red but it takes up the whole top right up here it's really cool and you can go ahead and do automatic colors and change that to four different colors um, signal options as well and extra tweaks you can do the same thing um, after you do that you go to Siage and mod settings and you can go to performance and inside performance is CPU settings and you can go to max CPU frequency and you can set it to 1300 if you like okay that'll make it really fast I don't do that I, I like you know it's fast enough as you guys can see me just touching buttons um, also in the app drawer you will see uh, the boot changer so now you can change your boot animations all you do is simply open that change boot animations and you can pick whatever one you like on here um, let's see I have already well, if you've already want you all you do is touch it and you can preview it hit download and change and use phone size you guys just pick that one okay I've already downloaded these so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to import animations and then I'm gonna go to boot animations And I'm going to grab one real quick, show you guys this. Alright, don't worry about this, it's just me actually picking a boot. For you guys to do it, just go to change animation and pick an animation and hit download and change and hit use phone size. After it does that, go back and go to tools. Up top, hit preview current animation. This is the one that I'm running. It's like a house or a phone booth in a tornado or something. 
All right, so we like the animation. Now we'll install sound binary. After we do that, we go to in we can go to import MP3 player. But first, before we do that, let's go open Ring Droid. There it is, Ring Droid. What we do in Ring Droid is we find any song we like. Open it up, and now we can use this to chop a song to any part of that song that we that we like. All right. So, what we're doing is we can just take this little bar and we scoot it across, and now we're chopping a song. Okay. After you find the part of the song you want for your boot animation, hit the little thing down here. Instead of ringtone, we're going to change that to music. And we're going to name it to whatever you guys want. Okay? Hit save. Now we go back to our boot animation changer. And we go back to tools. And now let's go to the import mp3. When we're in here, go to media folder and inside the media folder you'll have music and stuff that'll be stored there and all you have to do is simply touch it and go to music and I picked boot up that's what I named it now it's there dismiss now that that part of the song is part of my current boot up animation okay now I'll boot up the phone in a second, but we have all these cool icons. Um, you guys know about the theme. You know about um, the uh, boot changer, and that's that's pretty much it, you guys. You got all the icons. The phone's set up. We went into settings. We did all the settings. Oh, if you guys are going to do the uh, wireless tethering, on this after update, you're going to go to wi wireless and network settings. Go to Wi-Fi. No, not Wi-Fi settings. Sorry. Go to tethering and portable hotspots, and go to portable hotspots. Uh, the the portable Wi-Fi hotspot settings, and then go to configure. And what you're going to do is your guys is going to be locked with some password there. Just change the password, okay? If you have any problems, um, like me, I like having my uh, hotspot on the home screen right here so I can just simply touch it and uh, turn it on and off and how you do that is long press go to widgets and you go to uh, power controls and inside power controls you can pick portable hotspot Wi-Fi hotspot and then just check mark whatever you want and then when you hit OK it'll show a bar like that or if you just pick portable Wi-Fi hotspot it'll be one little box Okay, and mine's transparent. And and that's pretty much it. But here we go. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like when the phone reboots. But again, let the phone reboot for a second. You guys, this is AK Scroller from AKScroller.com. This is update four that you can find in the forms. All you do is go to the scroller room of hacks and look for the new 3D ROM update four. Works on any CM7 ROM or any uh my Scroller 7 V3 ROM. Also, let your friends know about us. We have all these other cell phones um, hacked, TVs hacked, Roots, ROMs, themes for all you guys out there. Um, this is the Cyogen Mod ROM running my uh, Update 4 for the Scroller 7 V3. So there it is, boot up animation changed. You got your songs playing. All that can be found here at akscroller.com. You guys that have the uh, update four on your phones, I hope everything is cool, calm, and collective. I hope you guys like everything that you're 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 getting on the phones. Here it is. Again, you guys, I I, I really hope that you guys enjoy everything that you find in the website or with the Android phones that we have today. 
God bless you all, and thank you. Oh, check it out real quick. I got a voicemail. See how it changes colors up top? That's pretty cool, right? And then my battery bar is above that red and that little green thing. Yeah, I love it. All right, you guys. God bless you all, and uh, that's how you set up the update 4 for your ROM. Thank you.